amazing and talented Catherine Hahn is back as the devious and cunning Agatha Harkness. Taking place a few years after WandaVision and Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness, we find Agatha still under the Scarlet Witch's spell. Interestingly enough, you would think that if a witch were to pass, the spell that they cast would no longer be. However, this is not the case for Agatha. This is partially what I have been enjoying about Agatha all along so far. Marvel is being very coy when mentioning or referencing Wanda and her demise. There is also a sense of mystery surrounding everything going on around Agatha, whether it's Wanda's current state, who Aubrey Plaza's real is, and why we and Agatha can't hear what the teen says when he mentions his name or who he is. I truly enjoyed how this show has begun so far, and the fact that a lot of the returning characters are the ones that we were made familiar with from WandaVision. Concerning the new cast, in these first two episodes, Joe Locke and Patty Lapone were the standouts for me. Aubrey Plaza's performance was also great, and the way that she uses her eyes to convey so much is so enticing and magical. Episode 3 of the series will be out tomorrow. This is Neophyte educating my fellow Neophytes one movie at a time. And don't forget to leave a like and follow for more Neophyte movie recommendations and reviews.